Welcome to Sapienza 47. Silvio Caruso's family home is right across the square. The bioengineer suffers from acute travel phobia, so the Ether Corporation has installed a state-of-the-art field laboratory somewhere below ground. Expect security levels to rise as you get closer to the virus. Good luck, 47. Francesca DeSantis is evidently having an affair with Caruso's golf coach, Roberto Vargas. A notorious ladies' man, Vargas has turned DeSantis's bedroom into a candlelit love nest and plans to call on her after his golf lesson with Caruso. Well, she should know better than to mix business with pleasure. Sir, don't. Understand? say that, but, uh, hey, a guy can change. So, did you get my message? Music to my ears. We'll meet up in your room, okay? I'll call you as soon as Caruso lets me off the hook. He's unusually patient today. No, please, surprise me. Ciao, Bella.
Nicely done, 47. DeSantis will be here shortly. I suggest you get in the mood. Circumstances, we. The situation, it's complicated. You see, either they come. Target down. Next up, Silvio Caruso. Dr. Lafayette speaking. Just so, I'm outside Villa Caruso now, enjoying a coffee in the sun. Lovely town. So, anything I should know about Dr. Caruso before our first session? I was briefed on his anxiety attacks, his genophobia. Hmm, very well. Don't you worry, Caruso is not the first troubled genius I have turned around. Just look at Jordan Cross. I'll have young Silvio calm and serene in no time. And you as well. It seems Ether Management is concerned about Silvio Caruso's mental health, no doubt due to his mental breakdown last year. They have hired world-renowned psychologist Dr. Oscar Lafayette to treat the neurotic bioengineer. The session will no doubt take place in private, and furthermore, our records show that Caruso and Lafayette have not previously met. Hey. Off a two.
looks Welcome. good. Gosh, there's so many. Uh, uh, Ooh, maybe I'll go for Sapienza. Sapienza. That's it. This is the town where the politician Marco Aviani died. Thought it sounded familiar. <laughs> Interesting. The place has history. Ah, this is going to be another one of your stories. Here. Yeah, no. Just, just to hear me out, okay? This is nothing like last night. The other night, I was out walking Fidel, and I see this convoy of black trucks with the Ether logo. No headlights or anything. Coming up the coastal road towards Villa Caruso. Yeah? Okay, Caruso works for Ether. He's got some kind of home laboratory. Like, I'm sure he needs chemicals and dry ice and shit. Really? Dry ice? That's all I remember from high school physics. What, what's your point? How about the hazmat suit? The hazmat suit? Oh, that's funny. Talking about? I, I don't feel all that well, actually. I caught a glimpse. Huh. Uh, do you want me to call someone? Just say the word. Okay, then? No? What? Ah, uh, you're not feeling good, are you? Yeah, you Whoa. know what I always do when I feel under the weather? Herbal tea. Yeah. Huh. You know what? You should lie down. Uh, you don't look too hot. Whatever the hell it is. And competition is fierce. A lot of industrial espionage. Oh. Hello, Dr. Lafayette. Oscar Lafayette. I have an appointment with Mr. Caruso. Ah, yes. Senor Caruso has been informed of your arrival. Please, follow me. I shall take you to his quarters. And may I say, it is well that you are here, Doctor. The Master has not been himself lately. I... well... I only hope you are as good as they say. Don't worry. I am. Have a nice day, Doc. Hello, Dr. Lafayette. Senor Caruso's private quarters. I will be downstairs if needed. Best of luck. A private therapy session with Caruso. Nicely done, 47.
the renowned Dr. Oscar Lafayette. Mr. Caruso, shall we begin? If you insist. So, Ether sends a specialist to rummage through my brain. They must think I'm losing it again. Relax. Start by telling me what's on your mind. Isn't it? Doctor, well, what? Doctor Laffy. Doctor Oscar Lafayette, here to see Mr. Caruso. Sorry, Dr. Lafayette, I have my orders. I can't let you through here. Entering the Ether Lab requires a key card and a uniform. Luckily, it seems both are within reach. Hey, Doc, how's it This field lab. You made it. The virus prototype will be close by. Look for some type of quarantine unit.
the air purification system clears the toxin. So you can enter without a hazmat suit. Just don't do it unless you're in a hurry. Thank you. We know it. In case of an accident, the central lab unit is kept perpetually doused in chemicals to stop the virus prototype from spreading. Entering without a hazmat suit is sure to be lethal. The air purification system is able to clear the toxin, but the controls are only operated by senior lab personnel. Time to kill the competition. Sorry. 